Adam Sling, your days are numbered. From Sylvester, Daniel, Theory 782. That is his uh, YouTube handle. And uh, I am looking forward on Tracy this, this uh, message and uh, getting the real face of this guy. Maybe next time that I will be doing my video, I'm going to post the real face of this guy. He said, Adam Slink, your days are numbered. So we should invite him and I would like to talk to him to get to understand what he means by your days are numbered. Meanwhile, let me do like Mubad. In case anything happened to me, I beg eh? The first person I will catch might be this uh, Sylvester Daniel. To so all my guys, make I know right from time for school for bullying every year. Sylvester Daniels, that's his name, and in this is YouTube. I'm going to trace him out and show his face so that I will tell all my guys there. In case anything happened to me, Mona Gumita. Now, based on your year talk, based on oppression, maybe they oppress me bad. Now, I make me bad to say, if, if anything happened to Rame, they go. Uh, that are mali responsible and unfortunately something called abutura even if no be naramali and samlari guam but because he mubad already talk and say be they go who naramali responsible that's why they go catch naramali if to say naramali no talk if to say mubad no talk no make that kind of statement i no think say they for go who naramali or samlari well sylvester daniel be rest assured, I am going to look for your face. I mean, I should show me that person. I a big search for people. I'm going to search for you and bring you out. <laughs> See, just even check my response. I say, ah, if anything happened to me, oh, this man responsible. <laughs> Don't worry. I will get you out. You know, we have so much to discuss. Of course, you saw the title of this video and, uh, and another issue coming from Ghana as well. But first, let me address this matter. Let me address this matter. Be careful what you uh, say because of one, uh, because you are a fan to one celebrity and whatever that celebrity is doing is not good and people are talking about it. You want to carry law. You want to call the yarn of butter. See, majority of people made it a threatening people and face face the person made it a threatening face to face. You know, and uh, if you are seeking for my audience, eh, Sylvester or anybody, seek for my audience. At least, if you want to do me anything, do me anything like make me fight. You go sign clause. Say if anything happened to me, if Adasli beat me, I pass their by. May they know who Adasli responsible. And me as will sign that paper to say if you beat me, I pass their by. May they know who you responsible. Uh, responsible. Then we fight. Now only wicked people. That they the hand person from the back. The only winch and wizard. They the hand person from the back. So that the person will not see their face. During the old days, during our great grandfather's time, you know, see how they, they battle their enemies. They, they battle their enemies in the press of war, war front with cutlass and arrows and the stick. Face to face fight, making no strong path. It's quite unfortunate, and uh, the recent uh, humans are looking for the easy way out. You see one uh, psychopath. Psychopath. Ordinarily, if you give that psychopath one slap, the psychopath will fence. But it would be a partial, trickish way to end uh, people's life. Now, the same thing as Sylvester did. Sylvester is a psychopath. And whoever is around Sylvester Daniel should be wary about him. That person should know Sylvester Daniel is a psychopath. Straight ahead. So guys, uh, let's move past that. Let's talk about this matter. I don't want to show the entire uh, passport of this guy. Apparently, this guy is from Nigeria. I don't want to show the entire passport because of uh, YouTube rules and regulation. We are not supposed. We are not supposed to show the entire information of anybody online. Yeah, the entire like a passport, well, all those things. We are not supposed to. Uh, 
not like a, an ID card. You are not supposed to show entire information of uh, anyone online. So it's uh, against YouTube rules and regulations. So according to the Igbo history and facts, they said breaking news in the Igbo. Our brother died yesterday in his room in Sanja, United Arab Emirates, UAE, and nobody knows about him. His name is Ifrain Judy Okuria. Please retweet to locate his family immediately. So, this man just passed away, and according to the date of birth, he got his passport in Lagos, and according to the date of birth, he was born. Terry April, 3rd April, 1989, from Lagos, is currently in Abu Dhabi, UAE. So the question now is, uh, Indibu, thank you very much for bringing this uh, this uh, this matter online and uh, also clarifying it as well. May so continue to rest in paradise. And uh, you know, after we say may so continue to rest in peace, then we have to see another thing else. Who how how this kind of young man take by? Wait till I put around. I get no CCTV camera. I'll be the man uh, go do just Ubatu. This one another Mubad case now. A young man like that will just buy. You get uh, any health uh, issues before. They say the man buy for a room. Is that a room? Please, we need photos of the same to know if anyone came in there. You know, courtism and everything in UAE from Nigerians. In fact, the courtes in Nigeria in UAE don't reduce a little bit. It don't they reduce more after they don't sanction uh, Nigerians. It don't they reduce more. So I beg, we want to know exactly what happened to. If I Judy or Korea, we want to know exactly what happened to him. You know, if a man died like that, you know, police will investigate now. Even not even considering the color of the man, they should investigate. So we really need to know exactly what happened to this man. We need to know exactly what happened to him. We need to know exactly what happened to him. So uh, of course, that's the first thing his family need to be asking. What happened to our son? What happened to our son? We need to know. So they should ask questions. They shouldn't just go and pick this guy up from the uh, for uh, transport this guy down and just go and bury him like that. Just exactly what happened to uh, uh, Obad. And again, in uh, in in Amsterdam, a Ghanaian businessman and owner of uh, East Ligon base. Uh, Shisha Lodge, that is uh, is called Kiki Bees Ghana, and uh, so the guy name is also is popularly known as Ben, has reportedly passed away in as in Amsterdam. Sources said and confirmed that he had arrived from Amsterdam. Okay, no, not in Amsterdam, in Ghana. Sources said he has arrived from Amsterdam last night and was attacked on his way home. After spending some time with his family at his lodge during the wee hour of Sunday morning, moment before his death shared on his natural attack, some weakness have alleged that he was tagged. A popular Ghana social alleged he was shot due to a uh, due to a business transaction and snitching. Investigations are on the way, and sympathizers are looking forward to hear or read a report of the true happening that led to his death. You know, you know, we all need to be careful. You see all those businessmen like there will be Kubana, uh, Kubana chief priest, their e money, and so many of those businessmen people who are there. So you understand why they need security, Abi. You understand why they really need security because of bad deals. Because of deals with they are dealing with themselves. It is always the same cycle that you see people uh, killing themselves. Always the same cycle. You don't know who you will offend, 
And to make it in this life like a big businessman, a really big businessman, you have to step on toes. You might step on toes on someone's toes that doesn't know how to control his emotions. And the only thing that person is thinking about is to make sure that he hands your life and so that you won't be getting that glory. Every businessman should know they have a very envious people who are trying as much as possible to see their downfall. Hmm? He might be your friend, he might be even your brother. But I hope you guys understand now why they are being by the carry police whenever they are going to clubs or going here or going there. Police, they there around them. So if anything one baguette, they know at least they protect themselves. And why some said they would they go by Balawo? Go protect themselves well. You see? Because you don't know who they pursue you finish. You might just be there relaxed until all is well before you know it. Bah. You just go hand your life for you, for your family. Make things unbearable for your family. Make life difficult for your family. So may this guy continue to rest in peace. And again, uh Sylvester Daniel. Yeah. I will source out your face. Don't worry. I'm telling you now. I will source out your face. Don't worry. Yeah? Don't worry. Mm. I will source out your face. There are better ways to be constructive. There are better ways to say, oh, I do not agree with whatever you are saying. There are better ways to say, no, you are lying. You can, ever, you can say I'm lying. You can even call me, ah, you are a fool, Adam Slim. You are this. Good and fine. People are insulting me now. On this hub now, Abba. I love, I love, uh, I love the attention. Not even sorry. I love the communication. I love the interaction, whether good or bad. But threat? No, no, no. Don't bring it to me. If you must threaten me, make sure see you feel call my face, face to face. Make we fight. If we can't fight, you, you, you me no say. No matter how you be, I will beat you. Like I will beat you well. Like I go, I go for fun do you. Not be asking thing you. I go for fun do you well. Don't be a joke. So come face to face. Come fight me instead of making threats.